At one point in my life, I was spiritually broken. Uh, uh, drug addiction, selling drugs, um, breakups, um, losing my friends, almost losing my job. Um, I just, I, I, rock bottom, that's the best way to say it. Almost rock bottom, very, very close to it. And uh, I think that's where the Bible says rejoice in your sufferings is because when you're suffering and you're broken, this is where God can show himself most strong in your life so you rely solely on him and not yourself anymore. I went online, I went to a few different churches and uh, one of them happened to be Lakeshore and I listened to Pastor Vince and I knew it was truth. I, as soon as I heard it, I just knew. And it, it kept me coming back again and again. I said, this is exactly where I wanna be. I just felt it and then I show up on Sunday. Why I wanted to serve is um, a multi-purpose <laughs> reason. One, I knew I needed to hold myself accountable. Two, because I needed a fellowship, and I thought that's a great way to get to learn people's names and stuff when I see them all the time. But how it came about was uh, two months prior to me serving on the security team ministry, uh, Wendy actually approached me and, and specifically and asked if I wanted to, to um, serve on the security team ministry. And there was something inside me that really wanted to say yes, but I kind of, I, I don't know what the reservation was. I'm gonna assume it's because it wasn't God's time for me to do so. And I still had the packet uh, she, she gave me because um, we do something here where they set up all the stands and all the different ministries you could serve in. So I still held on to it. It was on my nightstand. I go, no, I'm doing this. And I did it. And I certainly don't regret it. It's the coolest decision ever. I love what I do. I love serving. And it's and even, even though I'm on the security team ministry, I get to see people from the other ministries all the time. So I'm making more friends. But you should minimally have a conversation with somebody who leads or has been on that ministry for a while just to kind of get a feel for it. And uh, see, and just kind of take it from there. Let the Holy Spirit lead you.